congratulations to Penn State on winning tonight. They're, um, they've been consistently the best team in our league. And, um, you know, again, they showed that tonight. I thought we were close. I thought we had our chances. I'm certainly very proud of uh, the effort that our athletes put forth. And, um, you know, it's obviously disappointing to come up short, but uh, it's an occupational hazard. So um, I'm sure once we get some space from from this match, we'll be able to look back at a, at a very strong season and a, uh, a good showing in this tournament. And uh, hopefully we can build on that uh, in the 2013 season. Thank you all. Open it up for the student athletes. Um, Tori or Ashley, can you kind of talk about when you guys were playing role offensively and getting a lot of good attacks? What was the difference there from, you know, what, what led to the changes in the momentum shifts it seemed like during the match? Mm. Well, we definitely weren't, we weren't playing our game in the beginning. And I think it took a couple of, you know, some harsh words by people to just, you know, give us a little boost there and to start playing our game because, you know, in the beginning we were letting them roll all over us and we weren't really fighting. We were just, you know, backing away. And after a timeout, everyone decided that, you know, we're not going to go down without a fight. And I think the energy and the passion that that timeout brought really helped us on the court. And I think, you know, we started playing our game after that. You guys were up 23-21 in the third set, and obviously Penn State came back to win that, and then you guys went down, you know, six, seven to two early in the in the fourth set. Did that take some just kind of losing that lead there and late in the third set? Kind of take some wind out of yourselves or a little moment? I mean, kind of did it kind of you know did Penn State really capitalize on that in the fourth set to you know uh, mentality wise? I don't think the end of the third set really affected the fourth set very much because we were playing well at the end of the third. Um, you know, they only won by two points and we were really, we were right in there with them. So I think we took some good swings at the ball and we missed and by maybe inches at times. So I think that we were right there with them the entire time. Uh, Ashley, can you kind of talk about your injury? Uh, was it just an ankle roll or what, what kind of happened there? And you know, did you have to talk your way back into the match? Yeah, no, I just... I mean, I landed on her, and then, you know, I had to come out for a little bit, just get myself, you know, back in the game and relax a little bit, figure out what was wrong, and um, just, yeah, started moving around. I knew my team needed me, and I wanted to get in there and help out. So I got myself back in it. Uh, Ashley, you said uh, Thursday that it's a big deal for this group to get this program kind of back going towards a go for volleyball. and. With both of you coming back next year, I think this is a huge step in that direction. Just both of you kind of talk about the pride you take in the season you had and knowing that next year you can kind of move forward from what you did this year. Well, I mean, I definitely think we did a great job this year. Our This team was fantastic. The girls were great to work with. And, you know, there was a lot of heart and a lot of focus and a lot of determination in every single player on this team, whether they played or not. And, you know, we made it to the Elite Eight. And... You know, that says more than what we did for the past two years, and I think we have a great group of girls coming in. We're definitely going to miss the seniors. They brought a lot to our team, and they definitely stepped up at the end, but um, definitely look forward to get back in the gym, get better, bring this new group of girls in, and, you know, come back next year firing and ready to go. Tori, do you want to comment on the, the season and kind of going forward? Yeah, I think overall it was a really great season. Um, we had a lot of new roles on the team. We had a lot of new incoming players. And I think overall our team were really good friends on and off the court. And we got along really well. And I think we were just a good team. And it was fun to be around. So, And I'm excited for next season. We're just going to work hard in the off season in the summer and prepare for this moment now. And hopefully we can make it further next year. Anything else for student athletes? OK, ladies, congratulations on a great season. Thank you. Question for the coach. Um, can I ask the players that when you had that 23-21 lead that you know came out kind of seemed you know flat maybe in the in the final set there? Did, did that take any of the wind out of your team losing that late lead that could have put you up two one? You know, we talked at the at the change about the fact that you know Penn State is a, is a good volleyball team, and, and um, in as much as we've made runs on them, they made a little run on us. They sided out at 23-21, and uh, all of a sudden it's 23-22, and they scored a couple of reels. And, you know, uh, I think it's just the nature of the game. Uh, as far as the fourth, uh, they got on a, a nice serving run at the beginning. They 
had a couple that ticked off the tape that we couldn't get to, and um, you know I think that's that's kind of been uh, their their strength is uh, you know some strong serving combined with uh, you know uh, what I said to Russ afterwards they did probably one contact better than the rest of the league right now. You know they they find a way to cover a ball, they find a way to to dig a ball, they find a way to just make one extra contact that maybe everyone else isn't doing right now. And that, maybe that doesn't seem like a big deal, but when it's 23-22 and, you know, a ball that usually goes down doesn't go down because they can keep it up and play, you know, you know it, it has an influence. So did the third bleed into the fourth? I think they were mutually exclusive, but, um, you know, we were battling in there for a while and then, you know, once there was a little bit of space created towards the second third of that set, you know, it was 17 all, something like that, and then all of a sudden it was 2018. I think the athletes, um, you know, probably felt a lot a lot of pressure there because all of a sudden there's this moment where it hits you like, oh my gosh, this could all be over, and especially for the seniors. That's uh, that's probably a tough moment. Can you talk about the job Carly did for you stepping in for uh, Ashley there for a while? Yeah, we, we have uh, a lot of faith in Carl. She practices hard every day, and it's great that she was able to come in in this environment, play to such a strong level. I, I don't think it was surprising. Um, you know, we think she's a, a good volleyball player, and uh, we're excited for her future. And it's nice that she got some experience in this environment tonight. Um, can you kind of talk about obviously the next step would be to get further in the tournament? But how do you guys go about getting to that next step? Well, we just got to get better. You, you know, maybe we'll be one contact hitter. You know, it's uh, this is my. Uh, what is it, three months and change. So I've been doing this uh, not very long. So uh, I think I have a better understanding of this environment. I think I have a better understanding of uh, our institution and, and the culture that we're trying to develop. And, you know, I would imagine it'll take some years, but uh, I still believe that we can build a successful program. A, a national championship program at the University of Minnesota. And, uh, you know, that's the goal. Uh, oh, well, actually, that's that's the hope for us. The goal is to to play the best volleyball we're capable of playing, and, uh, and we'll see what happens from there. But uh, yeah, I think the it's a good season. Uh, it's a shame that it has to come to an end, as the athletes were saying. We've got a good group of athletes, and they're they're a good team. They play well together. Uh, but we'll uh, you know take a little bit of a breather and then uh, start getting ready for the next. Anything else, Coach? Coach, we appreciate your time.